10 Diabetes Nighttime Signs You Should Know Managing diabetes is a 24 7 responsibility, and the challenges don't disappear when the sun sets. In fact, nighttime can bring its own set of unique symptoms that every diabetic should be vigilant about. Understanding and addressing these signs can make all the difference between a restful night and a health-compromising situation. Let's discuss the top 10 critical signs you must not ignore when night falls because diabetes doesn't take a break, even after dark. Before starting this video, I would love for you to subscribe to my channel for more informative videos that will help you stay healthy and aware of diseases. Number 1. Nocturia Ever find yourself constantly waking up to use the restroom? It might be more than just a full bladder. Your blood sugar could be sending you a serious warning. Nocturia is a term that might be unfamiliar, but its impact is very noticeable, especially for people with diabetes. It means needing to urinate more often during the night. This often happens because high blood sugar levels make the body try to get rid of extra sugar through urine. Waking up frequently to go to the bathroom can disrupt your sleep, making you tired and less alert during the day. It's also a sign that your blood sugar might not be at a healthy level. To manage this, two important steps can help, regularly checking and controlling your blood sugar and being careful about how much you drink in the evening. If the problem continues, it's important to talk to a doctor, as there could be other reasons for the frequent urination. Number 2. Night Sweats Waking up drenched in sweat when the room is cool, your body might be signaling a dangerous drop in blood sugar. Night sweats are when you sweat a lot during sleep, even if the room is cool. For people with diabetes, these heavy sweats can be a warning sign of low blood sugar levels at night, called nocturnal hypoglycemia. This can happen due to several reasons, like certain medications, strong insulin treatments, not eating balanced meals, or doing intense exercise in the evening. Waking up drenched in sweat doesn't just disturb your sleep. It also shows that your blood sugar might have dropped to a dangerous level. To manage night sweats effectively, it's very important to keep track of your blood sugar, especially in the evening. Identifying and adjusting anything that might cause these drops, like your diet or exercise, can be very helpful. You might also need to check with a doctor to see if your medication needs to be adjusted. As a safety measure, keep something that can quickly raise your blood sugar, like glucose tablets or juice, by your bed in case you need it during the night. Number 3. Restless Leg Syndrome Restless Leg Syndrome is a condition that causes a strong urge to move your legs, often with feelings of tingling, itching, or a crawling sensation. This discomfort tends to get worse when you're not moving, which can make it especially troublesome at night. For people with diabetes, Restless leg syndrome is often linked to peripheral neuropathy, which is nerve damage caused by long-term high blood sugar levels. Managing restless leg syndrome when you have diabetes requires a combination of approaches. First, keeping your blood sugar at healthy levels may help reduce the risk of neuropathy and restless leg syndrome. Also, making some lifestyle changes like cutting back on caffeine and alcohol can help ease restless leg syndrome symptoms. Regular, moderate exercise is beneficial, but it's important not to overdo it, as too much exercise might make the symptoms worse. Some people find relief by massaging their legs, using warm or cool packs, or practicing relaxation techniques like meditation. Number 4. Sleep Apnea Sleep apnea is a condition where your breathing pauses or becomes very shallow during sleep, causing you to wake up often. This is especially worrying for people with diabetes because poor sleep and less oxygen can make blood sugar control worse and lead to insulin resistance. Obesity, which can cause sleep apnea, is also a risk factor for type 2 diabetes. To manage sleep apnea, a combination of lifestyle changes and medical treatments is often needed. Losing weight can help a lot, as even a small weight loss can improve symptoms. For immediate relief, many people use a continuous positive airway pressure machine, which helps keep the airways open while you sleep. It's also helpful to avoid alcohol and sedatives, which can relax the muscles in the airway. Sleeping on your side instead of your back can help prevent blockages in the airway. By managing sleep apnea well, you can see improvements in your blood sugar levels and overall health. Number 5. Nighttime Hypoglycemia Nighttime hypoglycemia means having low blood sugar levels while you're asleep. This is a serious issue for people with diabetes because it can happen without you realizing, leading to possible complications. You might notice symptoms like sweating at night, vivid dreams, or waking up with a headache. If low blood sugar lasts too long, it can cause seizures or even make you lose consciousness. To manage nighttime hypoglycemia, it's important to regularly check your blood sugar, especially before you go to bed. 
If your blood sugar is low, eating a snack that's rich in carbohydrates can help prevent it from dropping too much during the night. You may also need to adjust the timing or dose of your insulin or other diabetes medications, but only do this under your doctor's advice. Keep a quick source of glucose, like glucose gel or tablets, close to your bed to quickly raise your blood sugar if needed. It's also helpful to teach your friends or family how to recognize severe hypoglycemia and how to give emergency glucose or glucagon injections. Number 6. Nighttime Frequent Thirst Nighttime frequent thirst is a common sign for many people with diabetes, especially when their blood sugar levels are high. When there is too much glucose in the blood, it pulls water from the cells, causing the kidneys to make more urine to get rid of the extra sugar. This makes you feel very thirsty and can lead to needing to urinate often, even during the night, which can disrupt your sleep. To manage this symptom effectively, it's important to control your overall diabetes. Keeping your blood sugar levels steady is crucial. Regularly checking your glucose levels and adjusting your medication or insulin with your doctor's help is essential. Staying hydrated is important, but to avoid waking up often at night, try to drink fluids evenly throughout the day instead of in large amounts before bed. Also, reducing caffeine and alcohol can help because they can increase urine production. Recognizing and dealing with nighttime thirst is important because it not only signals high blood sugar but can also interrupt your sleep. Number 7. Nighttime Cramps Nighttime cramps are sudden, painful muscle contractions in the legs that can be very uncomfortable for people with diabetes. These cramps might be caused by high or low blood sugar levels, poor blood circulation, or diabetic neuropathy, which is nerve damage from long-term high blood sugar. To manage and reduce nighttime cramps, it's important to keep your blood sugar levels stable. Regularly checking your blood sugar and sticking to your prescribed medication can help. Gentle stretching exercises for your calf muscles before bed can help relax them and reduce the chance of cramps. Staying hydrated, getting enough minerals like magnesium and potassium, and wearing supportive shoes can also help prevent cramps. Taking warm baths or using heating pads can provide relief from cramps. If cramps continue or get worse, it's important to talk to a healthcare provider to find out what might be causing them and get the right treatment. Knowing these signs is the first step in managing diabetes well, improving your sleep quality, and supporting your overall diabetes care. Number 8. Morning Headaches Morning headaches can be a concerning sign for people with diabetes and are often connected to changing blood sugar levels during the night. Both low blood sugar, hypoglycemia, and high blood sugar, hyperglycemia, can cause headaches when you wake up. Sleep apnea, which is common among diabetics, can also lead to morning headaches because it disrupts sleep and reduces oxygen levels at night. To manage these headaches, it's important to regularly check your blood sugar levels, especially before going to bed, and to address any sleep problems like sleep apnea. Keeping your blood sugar stable overnight by adjusting your diet or medications with your doctor's help can also help reduce the chances of waking up with a headache. Number 9. Nighttime Anxiety or Restlessness Diabetics might experience anxiety or restlessness at night, which can make it hard to fall or stay asleep. This can be caused by both mental factors and physical symptoms, like changes in blood sugar levels, especially low blood sugar, hypoglycemia. When blood sugar drops, the body releases stress hormones like adrenaline, which can lead to feelings of anxiety or restlessness. To manage these symptoms, it's important to check your blood sugar levels before bed and possibly have a small balanced snack to keep your glucose stable through the night. Using relaxation techniques such as deep breathing exercises, meditation, or listening to soothing music can also help ease nighttime anxiety and improve your sleep. Number 10. Tingling or numbness in extremities. Tingling or numbness in your hands or feet especially at night, can be a sign of diabetic neuropathy. This is a type of nerve damage caused by long-term high blood sugar levels. It can make you uncomfortable and disrupt your sleep. If not managed, neuropathy can lead to more serious issues, including pain and loss of feeling in the affected areas. To manage this, keeping your blood sugar levels steady is very important. Regular exercise, a healthy diet, and following your doctor's advice on medication can help control your blood sugar and possibly slow down neuropathy. Wearing comfortable shoes, using warm or cool packs, and doing gentle stretches before bed can also help ease the tingling or numbness. You might also want to check out this video for more important diabetes signs, and please subscribe to the channel if you found this video useful. Thank you for watching.